Boom! What's up guys? Welcome to another episode of Urban Ghost Urban Exploration. It's been a really, really fun night. Uh, good to be back out again. Uh, except for the fact I'm in the middle of this freaking creepy uh, uh, junkyard in the middle of the night by myself right now. It kind of sucks, but... <laughs> this would be cool, some cool stuff to look at. There's a bunch of freaking cats running around. There's a bunch of other animals out here, so we're definitely hearing stuff out here, but it could just be you know creepy crawlies and, and whatnot but <sighs> crazy story about this place i guess this this is like a junkyard at least from the 40s original owner was a big fan of fords and evidently had a beef with somebody in the local area and they found him dead and i don't even know if you could see it like this ghost tube ghost tube at thingamajiggy i don't know it's free but, you know, while I'm out here, I wanted to play around with this and see if I can't, like, get something. I guess it does, like, voices and all kinds of weird stuff. So, I don't know. I thought it'd be fun to, while I'm around here to, uh, anyway, 30 minutes alone back here. Okay. I think, I think that was that. I think that was that because I know, hold on. I don't know how this thing works. It says Hello. I don't know if it's really not. It just goes to, but eh, be fun, fun to play around with, right? It's supposed to have like a SLS thing on here too, so eh. I don't know. Rest in peace. Rest in peace. Resting in peace out here. Get out of here with that. Anyway, let's go savage. Is that? I'm not sure what that is. It's all covered in stuff. Uh, so far, this thing has said Alexander, hello, and rest in peace. product placement here some CLA carnitine from BPI whoever owned this truck was a bro some other supplements die was, was that this thing oh my it's freaking cats fighting It's not focusing. It's not focusing. There we go. Sorry, guys. I turned off freaking autofocus. So. Cats trying to hurt each other. Anyway, back to checking out my, my bro bros. Stack here. What do we got here? Phosphor grow. Looks like he's got those energy pills up there. Some chew. My man was a bro. He was a bro and a half, I guess. You gotta be careful with those stinking supplements. That might have just been a car on the road, but it kind of sounded like. Something's over there. I don't see anything though. This thing is cool. Oh man, I walked in there earlier and I didn't even notice there was freaking spiders right there. Dang. <laughs> hate them. I hate them. I hate them. Weird man. I've seen a few of these at car shows when I used to go with my dad as a kid. 
all decked out and stuff. They can be real, real cool, but this thing is way past its sell-by date. Super cool, though. Looks like it's just underwater for like ages. So far, not really getting anything from here. Be cool. Maybe I can try this thing. Cause this thing's got like an it's got a SLS doodad on it. I don't know. I don't know what would be cooler. I'm trying to get the like an Oculus type thing. Is it Oculus? No, that's that Facebook thing. That thing that says ghost voices out loud. Sorry, I don't really know what the name is. <laughs> It definitely looks like it's underwater. Let's see if I can get anything to pop up. Uh, not really reading anything on my doodad here. Let's see if I can. Oh. And apparently, I don't know if you can see it because it's not, it's too bright. Hold on, let me change the thing so you can actually see. But it was coming up as a, look at that, it's coming up as a, as a, as a dude. Let me just film it, screw it. It's coming up as a dude. Or, or a lady, I don't know, a ghost thing or says something's there. It's supposed to like indicate when there's like a something there it's picking up. And it did and it just kinda goes away. Hmm. Interesting. That does little cool clips. That's cool. Let's see if we can pick up any Ouch, voices coming up here in my little hearse here. That's interesting. It's got air conditioning in the back so you can ride in style. I'm assuming there used to be chairs here. Don't know, never been in one myself. I've just seen them. Here and there, usually people deck them out. What the hell is that on me? Get out of here, stick. And, uh, that's cool. Old tractor. I'm on my way back here. Hello? Christopher. I think he said Christopher. Hello? That doesn't sound like a cat. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. Hold up.
He's taking photos. This thing is uh, Christopher. Hold on. All right. There you go. This freaking Joe, they're taking photos for Instagram. <sighs> Scared the shit out of me. Plus, this thing said Christopher. It's the same stinking time. <sighs> oh, spiders. Uh. I just went through here too, no wonder. Oh man, I knew I had spiders on me. Ugh. What the heck kind of noise was that? It was like blah, blah. Oh. Can't see back there at the moment. <sighs> Be back there in a second. This thing said a couple things. Christopher. Alexander. Rest in peace. And hello. Not much else though. It's not really super, super, super active. So who knows if this thing works or not. It says it's listening, so we'll see, you know, just for for fun, anyway. It's definitely, definitely uh, freaks me out, because you never know when it's going to say something, and I'm really focused on what I'm doing, and then all of a sudden it'll blur out something. <laughs> It's really interesting this I wonder if this uh, used to be the original owner's house and they just sort of made it into an office space not entirely sure really nice guy for letting us do this what is that a wrench here it looks like it it's hard. Hello? Hello? That one could have been the cat. Right now, I guess. So let's switch over to the SLS for a minute and see if we can't get anything that way. That well, better be the freaking cats, man. Hello? Uh, I was 
jazzed up until I got back here. And now I'm like, ugh, I keep hearing stuff. And this thing keeps saying things and telling me there's like people there or whatever. Somebody here? Uh, I walked back here before and it was kind of creepy. Joe walked back here and uh, when I got back to the car, I said it was really weird in here. Like, really creepy feeling back here. And uh, this car has a uh, airbag deployed, so I wonder. I wonder. Goodbye. <sighs> if we say goodbye to me. If you're saying goodbye, you better be leaving. I ain't say no goodbye. Ain't no, no goodbyes from me. I'm, I'm taking my behind safely back to the car and going home after this. We can say our goodbyes then. skis up there. I didn't notice this before. It does freaking feel weird in here though. That is true. So that little SLS thingy. Put a little stick figure in here. And I just got a voice thingy saying goodbye. And now I feel oddly strange. <laughs> I don't like this. These old golf clubs. It's cool. Why do I feel so funny now in here? Definitely gonna slip and fall on something. So. Somebody here? Trying to talk to me? There's bangs that I, and walking, whatever, that I think is the cats and animals back here. And then there's other things that don't quite sound like that. Sound heavier. <sighs> okay, it's going to be alright. It's going to be good. It's going to be alright. So, like you feel like you're being watched. Like that sixth sense, like something's about to happen. You know? I didn't feel that way before when Joe and I were back here together. Now, and I didn't feel that way up front, but now I freaking do. And I don't like that. I don't know what's changed. I feel very. Whoa, that's cool. It's gross, but it's cool. Everything's like super still, like something's gonna pop out on me or something. Like you feel like you're getting hunted.
past us off in the distance there. So very vocal and now nothing. Uh, not too sure about this. Not too sure about this app, but I do feel very strange. So it could also be because I'm walking back here in the middle of the night by myself in the junkyard in the dark. I could definitely, definitely be. You hear little creaks and crackles. Stuff from a distance. Uh, switch it back to SLS for a minute, see if we can. The heck is that? That's not like a stick figure, that's like a stick octopus. Look at that, standing right there in front of me and doing a doing the Macarena or the Hokey Pokey. Huh. That's definitely a, and then when I turn it doesn't go with the phone still in the same place huh interesting see doesn't go with the phone hello and that is just there it ain't going away nothing it's just there to it I'm like right on top of it now it's gone oh there, there it is huh I don't know guys it's not there oh now he's over there he's sitting on that little tire having a He's having a rest. Wouldn't that be crazy if that's the freaking old owner just still here? Just hanging around his old junkyard. Wondering why we're taking a poke around his stuff. That's some interesting, interesting stuff. Anyway, I don't know. I don't know how these things work, guys. I don't know. It's weird though. And it, it's a, sort of random. And it's sort of everywhere, right? It's sort of, I mean, a lot of the things have been near cars. And the two previous ones have sort of been in cars with airbags that have been deployed. So, could it be? Could it be? And this thing beeps every time it picks up a reading. There it goes. There's one over there by that car. Huh. Alright, that's cool. Let me, uh, let me switch back because there seems to be a lot of little stick figures. Maybe, maybe we'll get some, uh, uh, messages. There we go. Huh? See that? I got a reading over here. Now I can't stink and focus on the thing. There we go. Huh. Interesting. I don't think I have another flashlight with me. I'm just going to try to brighten it up just a little bit. I 
don't think the steering wheel's in that thing, so I can't tell if the air or anything was deployed. It's a nice couch out here. Oh no, the steering wheel is there. Start working my way back to the back here and back to the front. That should be about 30 minutos. Uh oh, my app crashed. Spring back up. Calibrating. Definitely talking. Or could it even be the neighbors are from the road too though? Clanging and banging. Get off me. Oh, they got walked over here before. Somebody's jamming out somewhere. You can hear. Let's go. Oh. Here's my little furry friend. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. How's it going? Hmm? Hmm? Let's see if there's any ghosts. You seen any kitty cat? Okay. You just gonna follow me around now for a little bit? I'm having trouble focusing again. Hey, kitty cat. Oh, Mercury. The old Toyota Camry. You know, my cat's gonna get real upset. She's gonna smell all kinds of smells. And you were just rubbing on yourself all over my legs. Like somehow I belong to you now. <clears throat> what was that beeping? Is it this thing? Start working my way up to the front. 
Working my way up downtown. Random. Huh. Sure. Yeah, that little doodad there wasn't as wasn't as uh, active as I thought it might be, of course. I saw something was just chilling on there on the on the uh, on the equipment there. Maybe that is somewhere over there like where I found him before. Just interesting. That means it's sort of still over there. This is cool. I really like that flatbed Ford though. That F100 there is so, so cool. I wouldn't mind having something like that just fixed up. Having my, uh, having my yard. Well, he was there, now he's not there. Now he's there. Or, no, I think he's just picking up that tree. Must be that tree. So most of the stuff seems to be happening up here. Not so much back in there. It's really kind of interesting. I hear the train thing off the distance. A little right on, right on my mower. Perfect timing and have a huge train noise. Apologize for the giant train horn, guys. Not a whole lot I can do about that one. <laughs> Is that John Deere? Air four Ranger. Air the four freaking Ranger. So it's doing its little beepy thing. Supposedly the owner's actual like run and gun car, run and drive, a daily driver. The heck am I talking about? I swear. Daily driver. Oh, there's a little bit of a hit over there. Huh. Anyway. Guys. Whew. Ooh, the chemicals. Hello, chemicals. I love me some chemical smell. Making me all woozy and stuff. Whoa, sorry guys. Whew. All right guys, that's it for my 
30 minutes alone. It's getting chilly. I'm gonna head back to the car and head home. This is a lot of fun, a lot of fun coming out. And, uh, Joe and I are talking about a trip real soon. It's a lot to sort of go into that with everything that's been going on. So, I'm letting you guys know as soon as we know. But merch is finished. Merch is done, guys. Check us out at ujimmybrothers.com. Um, by the time this video goes out, that's already going to be live. So just check it out, guys. Tons of new stuff. My girlfriend actually helped us out a huge amount with uh, getting those designs done for me, getting all the merch ready to go on the website, and helping me straighten out some things I wanted to straighten out on the website so it can go live. I know you guys have been asking me about that. We also have the coat tees that you guys asked me about as well. Um, I know you guys sometimes say I don't listen to you, but I do. I listen to you, and uh, so we have the quote tees, the stinking seeds, man. Um, the uh, It's Creepy Joe, and it's a bad idea for me. Those tees are back. They are back. New and improved. You can check those out at YouTubeBrothers.com. We have mugs and all kinds of cool stuff. Tons of content coming on, on both channels. And uh, working on some other other avenues for content, other things to do as well. Because Joe has some ideas, I've got some ideas. We're gonna have some fun, and uh, a lot of things coming down the pipeline, such as like cool contests to do for you guys, lots of giveaways, new stuff. I'm adding to Patreon for you guys who want to uh, join that platform as well. I'm adding new tiers to that and all that good stuff. So there's plenty of cool stuff on there. I'm really excited about this year. A lot of cool things coming this year, for sure. And um, honestly, it's it's thanks to you guys. You know, this is our fourth. We did this for four years. We're going on our fifth year now, and uh, we're trying to step up the game. Make sure cameras all good, all of our equipment's great, content is just dialed in. We have tons of cool stuff to give back to you guys as a thank you for all of the support for the last four years. Some of you guys have been with us since like the beginning, beginning when we had GoPros and we were just doing urbex during the day and stuff just stinking awesome and yes I say stinking a lot I think I get that from my dad so blame him for that and uh, yeah anyway much love to you all uh, just keep an eye out for things I, I do post a lot on the community page as well as the patreon stuff tons of stuff on Instagram um, as well if you want to join there and uh, I think that about sums it up 30 minutes alone in this creepy freaking place with tons of cool stuff in it and um, some cool cats and stuff running around. And I like good stuff. Anyway, much love to you all. Stay strong, stay blessed, stay savage. Peace, guys.